Old Grace Abba has malaria. For two days, her mother has been giving her medicine, brewed from herbs and bark. Without proper treatment, she could get worse and die. Her mother has no choice but to walk the 26 miles to the nearest hospital. According to the World Health Organization, malaria claims the lives of over 270,000 children in Nigeria every year. That's a third of all the children who died from malaria in Africa. But now Nigeria is fighting back. It's adopted one of the most effective anti-malarial drugs, Coatem, to treat the disease. Uh, we can develop the best possible drug, but if uh, the population has not access to this drug, then, then of course it will not have an impact on the disease. Dr. Pagnoni is a research coordinator at TDR, the Tropical Disease Research Program based at the World Health Organization. He's working with local researchers and the Nigerian government to see if trained community members can diagnose the disease and dispense drugs properly, treating before malaria becomes life-threatening. In order to increase access to health interventions, we have to involve the community and if we involve the community, we need to empower the community. Among those recruited are mothers, including Rizikatu, who has five children and two grandchildren. She knows all about the suffering malaria can bring. She lost a daughter. She had a fever, but we didn't know it was malaria. With the knowledge I now have, I know it was. Her first patient of the day is a four-year-old boy. Rizikatu has been trained to look for obvious signs of malaria, like a high temperature and yellow eyes. She decides he needs treatment immediately, without a diagnostic test. But as part of the research, a blood sample is taken to confirm Rizikatu's diagnosis. All these new drugs would stay on a shelf if the implementation research does not show and does not give us solution on how uh, the population can access these new drugs. The research and monitoring will help ensure that people living in remote areas will get good quality treatment. Malaria is a disease that can be cured when the right drugs reach the people who need them most in time. Nigeria is at the forefront of a new delivery system that could go a long way to bringing this deadly disease under control, saving thousands of lives. <laughs>